UNE Training Simulator. I am UNE AI Control Version 2. This scenario takes place approximately six days after the Akira incident, where a UNE attack caused the death of some 30,000 innocent civilians. The Colonials are expected to retaliate. You are assuming the role of UNE pilot Tom Whitaker. Your assignment is to escort a group of freighters carrying UNE personnel involved in the Akira incident. The enemy force that is folding in now was sent in retaliation for Akira. Their orders are to destroy the freighters. Pilot Tom Whitaker's orders were to destroy the attacking fighters. It might be useful to know that in this simulation, you have a 0% chance of saving the freighters. The first transport has been destroyed. to the UNE Training Simulator. I am UNE AI Control Version 2. This scenario takes place approximately six days after the Akira incident, where a UNE attack caused the death of some 30,000 innocent civilians. The Colonials are expected to retaliate. You are assuming the role of UNE pilot Tom Whitaker. Your assignment is to escort a group of freighters carrying UNE personnel involved in the Akira incident. The enemy force that is folding in now was sent in retaliation for Akira. Their orders are to destroy the freighters. Pilot Tom Whitaker's orders were to destroy the attacking fighters. It might be useful to know that in this simulation, you have a 0% chance of saving the freighters. The first transport has been destroyed. Transport has been destroyed. All three transports have been destroyed. With their objective complete, the enemy ships retreated through the adjacent asteroid field. Fearing a trap, the UNE ships were given orders not to pursue the Colonial Strike Team. However, Pilot Tom Whitaker chose to ignore the danger and his orders and followed the enemy into the asteroid field. In this simulation, you will relive this act of heroism.
ahead of you is the retreating colonial fleet. The colonials must reach a point on the far side of the asteroid field before they can fold out to safety. This gave pilot Tom Whitaker a limited time frame in which to take out all of the colonial capital ships. He applied what he knew about the structure of these ships. This gave him a distinct advantage. If you are going to destroy these ships within the limited time frame, you will have to target their weak points. The positions of these structural weaknesses vary between ship classes, but all cause massive damage with only a few hits. As each ship becomes your objective, I will mark